what's up guys welcome back to another video and we are in the beautiful Las Vegas now if you're new to my channel don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel it really helps and supports me today we are going to just vlog the entire day show you what we're up to and what we're going to eat now right now we're going to Mon Ami Gabi which is in the Paris Hotel I want to show you it because I can see it but so it's right there, like here, that's where we're going. Now, looks can be deceiving because it looks really close, but it's actually a half an hour walk and our reservation's at 9.30. I've heard really good things about this place and uh, we watch these vloggers, Bill and Lisa, and they talk highly about it. So excited to try and get going because I need some coffee. All right, let's get going. I got like an egg florentine and he got the three eggs with bacon, sausage. Okay, I'm gonna cut it to I wonder if you can see it. Pretty good, is it? This English muffin looks good. Your bread looks good. to get ready for the day and I just wanted to give an update on how Mon Ami Gabi is. It was pretty delicious and would I go back? Yes I would. The service was good, my Benedict's was good and he liked his so I would definitely go back and maybe order something sweet because the sweet stuff also looked delicious. So if you do come to Vegas and you want a good breakfast, Mon Ami Gabi in Paris Hotel is a sure win. And we're gonna get on the rest of our day. We're gonna walk through probably some of the hotels and uh, do a little bit of gambling and probably grab some lunch. So we'll show you. check out the MGM Grand. New York, New York is very quiet. I think it just reopened, that's why it's pretty quiet and they're obviously operating at a lower capacity. Um, everyone is wearing masks during this time, but yeah, no ambience. We're gonna check out MGM Grand. So we're now at Caesars, we're at the Vanderpump Cocktail Bar and uh, we've, we've been here before and check out my other Vegas vlogs and I got midnight oil. And he got checkmate the arch. Cool. So you have to wear your mask here when you're sitting down and you can only take it off when you're sipping or eating food. be 
been a hot minute since I have picked up the camera. We had a nice long nap after Caesar's Palace. And now it is eight o'clock and we are heading to Zuma here at the Cosmopolitan. And we want to show you what we eat, what we drink and how it is. So I'm excited to eat some lovely Japanese cuisine. Are you excited? I am. And the good thing is that the fact that it's in the Cosmopolitan, so it only takes five minutes to walk there. Win! So here I have, I have the lychee and the rose martini. Let's give it a try. Mm. Oh, it's delicious. If you like lychee, it's got this rose scent to it and it's like not even um, a lot of lychee flavor, but it's really tasty. And we ordered a bunch of food when we come in. And he got, what did you get? Zuma Mai Tai. So we have here um, the tofu salad and I've actually had it before, it's pretty delicious and then we have the ye yellow tail, I'm gonna try some of the tofu. How, how is the yellow tail? The yellow tail, you heard the first here. I'm gonna try some of the tofu. Oh my god, it's hot. It's really good, it's like citrusy. You're, you're meant to have it with the avocado. Thank you. 
to wrap up my review of Zuma. It was pretty good. It was pretty expensive actually because we had like quite a bit of alcohol. But I do recommend going to Zuma. The Japanese food is exceptional and I would go back there. It's actually my second time there and I really enjoyed it. So I'm going to wrap up the vlog for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, sorry I didn't vlog more because we did end up sleeping quite a bit taking a uh, old people's nap what you call it i do consider myself maybe an old person <laughs> but yeah hope you enjoyed this vlog don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like this video it helps and supports me and i will see you in the next one bye guys